significant figures. Significant figures are those that have a physical meaning. They were actually measured. Most people ask why we need to worry about significant figures. The significant figure rules allow us to perform calculations and give results so that everyone that sees them understands what uncertainty is in that reading. They know which decimal places are certain and which are estimated. Before we can use significant figures correctly in calculations, which is the goal, we must learn to count them. Here are five rules that show how to count significant figures. Only numbers that were measured are significant. All non-zero numbers are significant. Zeros in between non-zero numbers are significant. Leading zeros are never significant. Trailing zeros are significant if there is a decimal point. However, these five rules can be simplified into just two summary rules that are easier to remember and work with. The first rule gives instructions on how to count significant figures if there is a decimal point anywhere in the number. If there is a decimal point, start counting with the first non-zero number and count all digits to the end. This example has a decimal place. Start with the first non-zero number and count to the end. Again, there is a decimal place in this number. Start with the first non-zero number and count to the end. The second rule is for when there is no decimal point. Start with the first non-zero number and count until you reach the last non-zero number. This number has no decimal point. Count from the first non-zero number to the last non-zero number. Again, this number has no decimal point. Count from the first non-zero number to the last non-zero number. Many people ask why the zeros in front don't count. They are important in showing how big or small a reading is. The reason they don't count as significant is because if you change the unit by using metric prefixes, the zeros disappear. For example, 0 0.00250 liters is the same as 2.50 milliliters. The first number has three significant digits. The second number also maintains the three significant figures. Now that you can count significant figures, you can perform calculations with them. That skill will be covered in a future tutorial.